So what are some of these boundaries that need to be set and what is, what is a good way uh, to, to go about setting these boundaries in a clear way? What are some challenges that are associated with setting these boundaries? Well, first is communication on the subject at all. There's a lot of discouragement from even talking about it. Um, you know, it's seen as unsexy sometimes. Mm-hmm. You, you rarely see in a narrative, in a film, in a romance novel where someone says, do you consent to intercourse with me? Right. <laughs> That's so hot. <laughs> and, 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 and now you're seeing people actually fetishizing consent in that way oh, and really? saying, wow, that is so hot that you wow, asked. Wow, thank you. That was so clear and I feel accepted and loved. And yeah, mm-hmm. that turned me on. There's right. something about the word consent just in general. That it's just unsexy. It isn't sexy at all. Just the word. Yeah. Like, and, but then the, then the varying degree to which people want to be dominant or submissive, some men or women uh, wanting to be, you know, dominated in that way. I, I just watched Blade Runner again uh, yesterday, and there's this scene where <laughs> Harrison Ford, like, goes to kiss, um, I forget her, the character's name, the Sean Young character, and she, like, doesn't want to kiss and then he like she starts to run away and he goes and he slams the door and he grabs her and kisses her and then he s- makes her say uh you know say that you want me or say kiss me yeah, that's like, hot this okay now see yeah. that's that's very interesting to talk about because that i mean a lot of people would be like that's well that's what like i have a pet i have a pet peeve where i hate if a guy asks me if okay. he can kiss me because mm-hmm. it first of all it ruins the moment yeah second of all i feel like if they had to ask there's already doubt enough mm-hmm. that may, I probably don't want him to. And doubt is unsexy. Yeah. And so it's like, if you think I want to kiss you, just kiss me. Mm-hmm. Or if try. If you think I, I don't, then just don't. Mm-hmm. Don't be like, can I kiss? Because then it just ruins the moment. If I did want to, now I don't want to. To play devil's advocate as, yeah. as a naive man, <laughs> yeah. uh, I cannot count the number of situations I've been in where I have no fucking idea really? if, if a girl wants me to kiss her or not. Really? It's really true. And I've been very surprised in the past both ways, you know, thinking that I'm pretty sure I don't like I don't think this is so happening. Do you, but do you ask a lot? Do you? Uh, no, I don't think well, I you have know. asked. Like if they turn away, then they didn't. You know what I mean? Like you could just. Exactly. I mean, that's really more my perspective is just you can kind of try and, and just be very quick to go. Well, OK, sorry. That wasn't yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. No, no I worries. actually do think it is interesting how like. The, the challenge is being a guy because I think mm-hmm. we, we talk so much about the challenges of being a woman and how difficult that is but it's like guys are really expected to be very you know kind of aggressive mm-hmm. you know they're expected to dominate they're expected to like make the first move and everything so I think that's an interesting challenge where now you have to almost do both like you have to be like am I doing too much but I have right. to but I'm not supposed to but like I feel like it must be like yeah. walking on eggshells now you don't want to put on a vibe of not asking for consent you know right you but don't at the want same to time you violate. still want to be a man yeah yeah whatever that may be in yeah this whatever day that age, means yeah, yeah.